Okay, Chris Bryan here again. Now, the inverted quarter note triplet. Now, this one is exactly the same as a quarter note triplet. If you don't understand the quarter note triplet, go back to the previous video on quarter note triplets. So, you got my hair's in my face, sorry. So, you're going to have. Now you should know by now that comes from the right hand playing triplets. Because whenever you're playing triplets, you're playing quarter note triplets all the time. Inverted coordinate triplets, shimmy you're going right, left, right, left, right, left. Inverted coordinate triplets, the left hand. Starts on the end of one. So you get this. Two, three, four. It's that. Okay. So the, the way you're going to count it, now, if, you, if, you, if this confuses you, watch the previous video. Then you'll understand what, understand what I'm doing. Don't try and take shortcuts on YouTube because it's not going to work. Okay, so the way I'm going to count this is simply this. I'm going to go one, two, three, four, and two, uh, and two, uh, I'm counting two, four times. Four, four times, be and two, uh, and four, uh, anyway. So starting on the and, which is the gap, then the two, and then the ah. Uh, I'll play it in two, four times. Slowly. One, two. Two, one and two, one and two. That's in the gap, then the two, which is with the feet. One, two, one and two, one and two. And then the art, which is the first note on the floor tom. If you don't know what that is, go back to the earlier videos. Don't take shortcuts. So you're going to get this. One, two, up, one, two, up, one, two, up. What do you think of four, four time? One, two, up, two, and four, up, so and two, uh, and two, or oh, one and two, uh, three and four. However, you want to hear it, uh, da, da. you got to learn it. So, up to tempo around the kit. One, two, three, four. Now, this one's used, and many uh, hard rock bands use this as a shuffle beat. The, um, I remember Marilyn Manson's Beautiful People did something like this. Lots of bands do this. So I'm going to do the one and two uh, and four on the left hand. But two and four, I'm going to do a rim shot on the, on the snare drum. You get this. If I play it all on the floor tom, and I on the up where it meets the floor tom, so I get, I, if I go like, I'll do it on two, two floor toms. So I do this. On the up, uh, I'm going to go, um, instead of going uh, one, I'm going to go and a one. I'm going to put the left hand in between the shuffle on the right hand side so you get this. Anyway, you end up with this. Two, three, four. Which is very simple. There's nothing complicated there. But anyway, so anyway, that's the, the, the coordinate, inverted coordinate triplet. Three, four. So I'll play coordinate triplets. And inverted coordinate triplets, some improvised concept on the kit. Very simple. One, we've got to get the tempo three in my head. One, two, three, four. Put some anders in there and one ands and add all those patterns we've done so far. You end up with something like this, maybe. Two, three, four. Is what you can do with it. I've never played that before. That's easy. So that's the, the coordinate triplets and the inverted coordinate triplets. Now, next lesson, we go into groupings of four in triplets, which are quite cool. So thank you again. Chris Bryan, your friendly neighborhood percussionist. Woohoo! <laughs> Gotta love these Bosphorus symbols. Thank you. <laughs>